when selecting a proper soldering iron to uh, work on circuit boards is important not to get one that's too big or too small. Uh, one I've, I have purchased is a 60 watt with a variable control dial on it. It's more than adequate to do anything you need to do with the uh, circuit boards. 60 watts is when it's on high. Have it about three quarters of the way around is about say 45 watts of power. To prepare the soldering iron for the first use, it's important to to tin the tip as it's referred to, which means you put a little pe you you coat the tip with solder. To do this, buy yourself a roll of rosin core soldering wire, which means it has the flux inside the uh, solder itself, rather than having to deal with applying it to the surface. And to do this, just put a little bit on the tip and take a cloth and just wipe the tip off. And you'll see it's a bright, shiny silver color. That is referred to as tinning. And that gives a nice conductivity of uh, heat to the piece you want to heat up. And just to heat up a piece on, you select the piece you want to heat up on the board and you just touch it on there and you'll see it'll, it'll go molten very quick. That's all you need. You don't want to put too much heat on these boards because you could damage a part on there.